Hey what's up guys welcome to find gap youtube channel and in today's video i will teach you how you can upload product on your woocommerce website using woocommerce test api so friends video is going to be more important and before start i request you to subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos let's start so friends first of all i need to open the google and search here for my wordpress website which is on localhost the folder name is cubic soul and i need to type wp admin to open my admin panel so when you will log in on your wordpress here you will see a woocommerce option next you have to click on settings and here you will see an advanced option here just click on this and click on this rest api option just click on this and next you need to click on this add key button here you can write a description that for which purpose you are creating this api key suppose i will type here for manage products and from permissions you need to select read and write if you want to insert and retrieve data as well from your database next you need to click on this generate api key and from here make sure to copy these consumer key and consumer secret so first of all i will click on this copy button and i need to create a text document here name this api key and inside this notepad i will save my these both keys the consumer key and this consumer secret next i need to open my hdocs folder here which is in c click on xam hdocs and here i will create a folder name api tutorial next i need to open this folder with my visual code studio and here i will create a file name index.php to add product in your WooCommerce website using REST API, first of all, we need to integrate the WooCommerce SDK in our project. So first of all, open the Google and search here WooCommerce REST API SDK. And from here, you can see that this link uh, with website github.com, you just need to click on this link, scroll up. You can directly download here by clicking on this download zip button or you can use Composer to easily integrate this to your project folder so first of all i will copy this composer command and now open your htdocs folder open your api tutorial folder and here i have to click on this address bar and type here cmd here paste this command and press Control enter not Control enter sorry directly click enter button one thing to make sure that you must have installed composer on your computer to run this command if your laptop or computer has not installed composer you you can click on the i button and install the composer first then paste this command here and hit the enter button the composer will automatically get the required files and set up these files in your project so friends here you can see that the woocommerce sdk have installed in our this project these were the required files the next thing you have to do is from their website just you need to copy this code and paste this inside your index.php and from here i will remove this word and also you know you need to remove this word and here i will create two variables first of all open this api key text this is the consumer key i will copy this and store this in a variable like consumer key is equal to paste this key here and the next thing is you need to copy this consumer secret and i will create a variable here consumer secret is equal to and paste this key here next you need to pass these two variables here inside this class so i will type here consumer key and consumer secret and here you need to paste a video uh, url here so to paste a link here first of all open your browser and here i will you can see that this is the url of my website localhost cubic so if your website is located on a server like www.abc.com you simply need to copy that url and paste at this position so here you can see that my website is loaded now i will i will copy this url paste this url here and the next thing is you need to open a google and type here woocommerce rest api documentation here you can see the website so this documentation is located on github website you need to click on this and from here you have to click on this products so click on this products and then you need to click on create a product after this you have to select php from here copy this complete data object from here and paste this here so here you can change the information of product that you want to upload but one thing more 
you need to copy this and paste this php line here and you can change the name of the product its price description short description and also if you want to upload images maybe two three four you can paste the url of these images here currently they have given two images link here if you want to upload three images you can simply copy this and type here a comma and again paste here and here you can paste the link of your third product image this is the default uh, shared image you can paste the image url here that you want to upload so suppose i will type here like test product upload so the remaining description i will remain them as the same so now just we need to refresh our this page so open the google and i need to type here localhost the folder name is api tutorial so i will type here api tutorial hit the enter button so friends here you can see that the product have uploaded successfully on our website using woocommerce test api and this is the response from from our server the product name and other things so these are not all parameters if you want to upload more parameters like the sku of a product or other things you can read these things from the documentation and next at the last we need to check that whether our product is displaying on the website or not so i will click on this shop page and friends here you can see that this is test product upload and it is it is the price of the product so i hope you must like this video if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section and here you can see that there are two images that we were uploaded and hit the like button if video was helpful and share this video with your those friends who want to learn web development and finally thanks for watching